We conducted a preclinical study as part of our development of the MetaPower Essential Oil Blend. Confirming clinical research is needed, but these results are so exciting. As you may know, doTERRA used to have a blend with the same essential oils as MetaPower. Grapefruit, lemon, peppermint, ginger, and cinnamon bark. That blend was slim and sassy. Yes, slim and sassy contained the same essential oils as MetaPower, but in different ratios. We wanted to know if the ratios of these essential oils could be optimized for even better metabolic performance. We took human adipocytes, also known as adipose fat cells, and put them through a maturation process. As you expose a fat cell to different stimuli, the cell will mature and accumulate fat droplets inside it. In this image, you'll see little balls appearing inside each fat cell by day 14 of the maturation process. On the left are immature cells, mostly flat and empty of fat. And on the right are cells full of fat droplets. They're much larger than the flat, immature fat cells. We conducted a dose-response study with different versions of MetaPower and Slim and Sassy. This image shows the results we found from dosing the adipocytes with the original Slim and Sassy essential oil blend. You can see that even at fairly low doses, it inhibited fat deposition within these human fat cells. We were excited, not too surprised, to see that Slim and Sassy did a great job modulating fat deposition. Next are the results from dosing the cells with a different formulation or different ratio of the five essential oils. You can see this version didn't perform as well as Slim and Sassy with inhibiting fat deposition. It still had an effect, but the results weren't as effective as the original formulation. And then we have the results from dosing the cells with the formulation that's now known as MetaPower. This was the blend or ratio of essential oils that demonstrated the most effective results. We were stunned to see that by optimizing the ratio, the desired results were significantly enhanced. See how much less mature the red fat cells are on day 14 with the new blend compared to the control? This bar graph shows the three examples I just described side by side for a little bit different perspective. We tested different strengths, ratios, and blends until we arrived at this formulation. It's the most powerful version, and that's why it became the official formulation of this amazing essential oil blend. <laughs>